FD. I feel like K9 said, you want to just go to FD? And then Mono was like, okay, yeah. Mono again is going to be looking for an up throw. Speaking of up throw rests, um, Mono is going to be looking for those. As I was just saying, K9 does a smart punish, up smash, poor DI on the up smash from Mono into another up smash. Ooh, that's going to be the stock. Oh no, we missed the roll. That is exactly the type of edge guards that Mono needs to be going for. Another up throw rest. Oh no. This is looking very dangerous for K9. Misses the punish because a charged up smash would have killed Puff. I'm not sure if an uncharged would have. Maybe for Pikachu. Um, Mono reading some ledge guard option. Probably double jump Phantasm or something. Um, K9 is going to be fishing for up smashes. Speaking of up smash. K9 closes out the first stop. Um, K9 isn't throwing lasers, actually. Oh no! Oh no! It's another one. K9 looks a little bit frustrated at that. Oh. See if he can run it back. We don't want to be caught um, in shield. Nice shine. Um, K9 wants to rack up damage. Ooh, very nice series of hits there. Ooh, standing laser. Not the right, not the right execution. Able to safely make it back on stage though. Um, see, in these situations where Puff is recovering, Kanan should throw lasers at Puff because we want to rack up Puff to um, solid back air, solid back air um, kill percent instead of having to reply or er, rely on up smashers and up airs. Can you pull up the melee bracket? Uh, you do it. Right up here. Um. Mono is fishing for these up smashers, or these up airs, up throws. Wow, goodness. Isn't going to need it though. Takes game one pretty convincingly. Let's see if K9 responds with Pokemon Stadium as his counter pick. Um, I don't imagine him switching to Falco or um, Black Shirt. Yeah, it's not going to switch. Instead, opting to go for platforms. Ooh, jab reset, that could have been a rest right there. Oh. Up throw rest isn't going to work at this percent. Oh, K9 charges an up smash. It's not going to be enough to kill. I think that shooting lasers and then doing an uncharged up smash will do more damage. Um, Mono is probably not going to be looking for rest kills for the rest of this stock though, because K9 can just respond with fully charged up smash. Um, K9 needs to be careful not to get caught on the ground like he was a little while ago. Nice down smash from K9. At this percent, up throw up air will kill if we can land it. However, K9 looks like he's going to be content to just go for back air. These recoveries from K9, you'll notice that he's double jumping out and then using Phantasm to hit the ledge. Very smart. We don't want to. He doesn't want to jump in and then get caught by one of Jigglypuff's aerials, namely back air. Um, Mono has been going for these edge guards. He, was, he has been successful, and K9 has adapted. Very nice back air, meanwhile, from K9. Close out the first stock. Oh. Mono is getting caught on the ground um, right now. Oh, bad recovery from K9. Built up a solid 62% though. There's extra credit there. Um, up throw, up air. Mono has not... I don't think he's DI'd a single up throw. I think K9 has been doing those up throws pretty fast. A little bit greedy on that um, rest there. Uh, Mono should look for rests off of other attacks. Pound combos pretty nicely into rest if you hit near the end of pound. Um, some of Puff's aerials, namely up air. Meanwhile, another up throw up air from Fox. But Mono is getting caught in, um, ooh, nice back airs. Getting caught in going for shield grabs at low percents to get the up throw rest combos. Oh, he needed, I think he needed one more shine to take away. Oh. 
Marlon's been getting shined. That's the second time off stage he got shined multiple times. But at high percents, Mono is getting caught fishing for really strong smashes. K9 convincingly takes second match. I imagine he'll bend Dreamland. Um, the only benefit that Fox will get from Dreamland is that he won't die at zero from rest. The thing is, he'll have to DI, and I'm not sure if he'll be fast enough to actually get backstage. We get Dreamland though. So, Dreamland will give Fox quite a bit of room to run around and shoot some lasers, um, which is just what K9 opened up with. These dash attacks though, I don't like these dash attacks from K9. If Mono shields these dash attacks, he can respond with the rest out of shield. Um, I don't think Mono goes for those yet though, I haven't seen one, but K9 has built up a sizable lead. Ooh, that getup attack was really well placed. Oh no. Air dodge straight into the stage. That's not the air dodge we wanted. Shine spiked Jigglypuff at around 90 though. K9 just needs to keep moving since Puff is pretty slow. Um, Mono is relying on Pound. Again, to get in, he should really go for back airs. Um, keep saying he should go for back airs, but back airs really good. That could have been a rest kill right there. Um, I don't know. Hopefully, Mono will rewatch his set. Um, point out every single one that can be a rest kill. Ooh, smash the eye there. Very nice. We're not able to convert that dash attack into an up air. K9 is getting pretty greedy for these shine spikes. It's okay. Like, he doesn't need to be doing that at this percent because two more solid back airs. It's going to be enough to take the stock. He just needs to play patient. Wait for Mono to throw out a pound. <laughs> Sorry about that. Wait for Mono to throw out a pound. Or just trade with Nair. Either one works well. Um, but when Mono gets behind, he tends to play a. Like, he tends to try to get in a lot more. Nice edge hog from Mono. And unfortunately, his move of choice is pound instead of back air. Mono down, stock and a half. Um, I do wish he would go for up throw up air, or up throw rest, actually, at this percent. Because in order to run this back, he needs to kill Fox quickly. Ooh, I don't like these rollout recoveries from Mono. Um, he has missed the stage in the past with them, resulting in a lost stock, of course. Solid back air from K9, using that platform to conceal his um, conceal his intentions there. Ooh, that could have been jab reset there. Jab reset into rest. Oh no, Mono, please use pound. Use pound. One more pound. There we go. Just stay on the ledge. Oh. Mono needs to time he, his um, ledge rolls because that's the second time he's gotten a hit off the ledge with Firefox. First time it would have resulted in a stock from K9. When Mono gets shined by Fox, he tends his recovery with his double jumps tends to be like a straight line, completely upward. You see it right there, and so it's very easy for.